Hey, how's it going folks? E.T. here with another iMovie tutorial for the Mac. And in today's tutorial, we're going to show you how to mute like a sneeze or a burp or a cough or any little piece of audio that you're not interested in having in your content. All right, let's create a new project here. Hit the plus, hit movie. And let's go ahead and find this little video I just made. I think I got to import it actually. From right here I just did a little quick video recording of my Splatoon amiibo here so let's import that and within here I have voiceover on it and then on part of it there's a section of the video here where I actually do a fake sneeze so I just wanted to show you how to go ahead and get rid of it let me go ahead and make the video as big as possible so you can see the audio track nicely okay so within this video there's a couple sections of audio I really don't want here. There's a little bit here. I can see that I I'm not going to want that here. A little bit of background noise there. And most importantly, let me hit the M on the keyboard. Uh, and it'll give us a little marker there and there. So this is the sneeze section right here that I want to get rid of. All right, there's a couple ways to do it. Um, if you want to just do it simply... You can put a cut before and after a piece of audio. So let's do that. We'll just go ahead and uh, either Command B on your keyboard or you can right click or and hit split clip before and after the video, the, the section that you want. And then you can just grab this little audio line here and bring it down to zero. Okay, so that's one easy way to do it. Let me go ahead and just undo what I just did by using Command Z. It'll remove everything I did. The way that I prefer to do it is you hold the R key on your keyboard and you'll notice that your mouse has an extra icon there. Then you drag over the section that you don't want. And then from there, you can just drag down your audio as low as you need it to be. And now it's finished. Okay. So let me go ahead and show a couple areas here. This I can tell like right here. It's really low audio, probably like background noise or hum or some clicking or something. And you can listen to it on your um, while you're editing and decide if you need to reduce it or not. So let me do that. Hold our R key here, drag, and then pull that audio down. Let me just control Z to undo this. Or if it's at the beginning of your video and you don't need this section at all, you can grab the corner and just pull it all the way in until you get to the point where you don't have that audio at all, like that. A little bit more, it looks like. Right there. Okay. So if you're in here, again, you can do the cut before, cut after if you decide you don't need that section. But I found the fastest and the coolest and the easiest way to do it is just hold the R key and just drag on that section. Again, you probably want to listen to it before you do this and make sure that, you know, it's audio you want to get rid of. Maybe there's some background noise that you kind of want in there. Maybe there's not. So I can tell in this situation, I definitely don't want it. It's probably me breathing. Okay, this section here, I'll listen to it. And I can tell from here on, I don't need that either. So again, we're just getting rid of sections that we don't want, whether it's a cough, a burp, a sneeze, some background breathing. Sometimes at the end of words, I can see there's a little hump there. I know it's probably me taking that breath or right before a word. I'm going like, <sighs> and you hear like the breath, yeah? So I probably don't need that little section here either. So I'll go ahead and uh, reduce that. And again, you don't have to do all this, but to me, sometimes I think it's nice to not hear the breathing, <laughs> you know, um, especially if it's like <gasps> something like that <clears throat> or a cough, like I just did. And these little sections here probably you can't hear them but sometimes it might be mouse clicks or keyboard clicks so i'll go ahead and get rid of those two here but yeah that's pretty much how you do it like i said you can do a cut before and after or you can just hold that r key and just drag and once you highlighted your section you can go up or down with the audio okay all right that's it for today's tutorial thanks for watching and we'll check you next time peace and aloha